It is now time for story time with Aaron Bowen. Aaron Bowen. Today's book is a book called Flossie and the Fox. Now what we're going to do for this story, Aaron, is each time you touch my nose, that cuts me on. If you touch it again, it cuts me off, okay? If you touch this ear, I get louder. This ear, I get lower. If you touch my chin, my voice is going to change, okay? You ready? Wait, well, you got to start. Let me get started first. Let me get started. Let me get to the beginning of the book. Got you off. Start a jet. You ready? <laughs> Here we go. You ready? The sound of Big Mama's voice floated past the cabins in Sophie's court. Love that. What? Not cutting on. Round the smokehouse, beyond the chicken coop, all the way down to Flossie Finley. Flossie tucked away in her straw down in the hog. Then hurried to answer her grandmother's call. <sighs> Here I am, Big Mama. Flossie said after catching her breath. It was hot, hotter than usable Tennessee on this day. Big Mama stopped sorting of peaches and wiped her hands and face with her apron. Take these to Ms. Viola over at the one or the other. At the Mick Cutcher place. She, she, she say reach, she say reaching behind her and handing Flossie a basket of fresh eggs. Saying like they've been troubled by a fox. Makes me only chicken be so scared. They can... Yes, about that. They can't even now... A stone, big mama clicked her teeth in her something. Why can't I come to the big kicking sparks of the dogs? Flossy asks, putting a peach in her apron pocket to eat later. Every time they corner that old stick tree, gets away. I tell you, that fox is one sly critter. How do a fox look, Flossy says. I just remember ever seeing one. Big mama had to think a bit. Chili a fox be just a fox, but one thing for sure that rascal loves eggs. He'll do most anything to get at some eggs. Flossy took the basket under her arm and started on her way. Yes, Flossie answered. The way through the woods was shorter and cooler than the road route under the open sun. What if I come upon a fox? Oh, oh well, fox be to the fox. They ain't. They ain't so scary. Flossie came in to skip along when she came upon a critter she couldn't re recollect ever seeing it chin. He was sitting side to run after you with a big somebody. Flossie skipped right up to him and nodded agreeing the way she had been taught to do. Yeah, Miss A.C. Critter replied, and what is your name? I be Flossie Finley, she answered. With a proper courtesy, I reckon I don't know who you be either. Slowly the animal circled around Flossie, I am a fox. He blew it out all the time, I ain't a basket of eggs. He stopped on front of Flossie, smiling the fox with a conch cat and mouth and a Flossie rocked back on her ears and reckoned for fun of the Carefully stood her the quick row was climbing to be a fox. <laughs> nope, she said at last. I just pray don't believe it. You don't believe what, Fox said, looking away from the basement of eggs. For the first time, I don't believe you're a fox. That's what. Foxy <laughs> 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 me. Okay, let's try it the other way. Now let's try it where you gotta bump my head to get me to talk, okay? No. Okay? Okay. Down the road, a pick. Flossie stopped by a bubbly spring. She knelt to get a drink of water. Fox came up to her and said, I have a long pointed nose. Now that she... No, when did you do that? You took all that. Should be proof enough. Don't prove it. No, that doesn't cut you off. That cuts you off. Okay, I'll read. If I mess up, you got to bop my head, okay? Okay. Don't prove a thing to me. Flossie... Picked some wild flowers. Come to think of it, she she said matter of fact like rats got long pointed noses. She snapped her fingers. That's it. You are a rat trying to pass yourself off as a fox. That near bout took fox's breath away. I beg your pardon, he gasped. You can beg all you, can you want to. Yes. Flossie says, skip it on down the road. That still don't make you no fox. This book's too long. No, okay. do it. The moral story is, I don't know. There's Flossie and there's a fox. Uh, say, Aaron, remember God loves you. Remember God loves you. Bye. 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 Uh-oh. I'm stuck. Bye. Bye-bye.